The shattered glass on the floor of the police vehicle is a stark reminder of how close two officers came to losing their lives. We believe that perhaps at least one of those rounds went through the vehicle, if that makes sense, so it entered the cabin space. A police task force has been set up to investigate the two shootings on Monday night near New Norfolk. One police vehicle was targeted on Glenfern Road, the other on Boyer Road. Robert Gregg, the man police believe was behind both attacks, is still at large. If you can hear this or see this or read um, anything about what we're trying to do, the message is that we want to take him into custody safely. Police are yet to locate the ute they believe he's driving, but say he may have repainted his car to avoid detection. I think if you remember the public and you see something that, that you think could be relevant in relation to the vehicle, um, I'm just saying that we, could, we can't discount that something could have been done to it. Well, police don't believe Mr Gregg poses a danger to the wider community. They're still asking members of the public not to approach him, but to instead call police immediately. Liz Gwynn, ABC News.